Hello everybody, my name is Contrice and welcome to my channel. My goal is to inspire and motivate through fashion. Words of encouragement are just simply being authentically me on purpose. So if that interests you, stay tuned. All right, guys, so today I am going to be showing you some of my favorite luxury consignment finds that I've had for um, some of them a couple of years. Um, as some of you may know, I am a former um, consignment boutique owner, so I am really, really, really big on finding great deals. Um, even when I buy brand new luxury items, I always get them on sale. I am not the type of girl that needs to have something straight out of the store off the rack as it first comes out and pay full price. That is not me. That is not my thing. I love nice things, but even more than that, I love a great deal. So I'm going to show you some of my favorite finds. Um, I have many, many more and I can do quite a few more videos on this particular topic. But on this one, I'm just going to show you some of my top um, finds that I've found in the last couple of years. So let's get started. All right, guys. So the first ones I'm going to show you are these Manolo Blahniks. I've wore these in a video before, probably a few times. Um, I paid $95 for these um, from The Real Real. Actually, most of the things that I'm going to show you today, I actually got from The Real Real. They're not sponsoring this video or anything like that, but I just love shopping with them. Um, also with local um, luxury consignment stores as well, where, wherever I'm at. But um, The Real Real is online and it's just easy to go there and look and find great deals. So I found these for $95 on there and I love the details. They have the leopard print and the calf hair. Um, the embellishments are absolutely beautiful. I love these so much and they're very comfortable. Um, so you can wear these like all night with no issue whatsoever. So these are one of my favorite Finds, luxury consignment finds. And let's move to the next. All right, guys. So the next one is going to be this Louis Vuitton monogram crossbody bag. I actually got this last year for my 40th birthday. And um, I wear, I wore it all year. Um, whenever I buy a bag for my everyday use, I wear it all year so I can get my investment worth. I am not a girl that changes bags every day. Um, the only bag, only time I ever change my bag is if it's like for like a party or nighttime and I'm just carrying like a clutch or a smaller handbag, then I will put my keys and stuff in there. But I just don't have time to be trying to change out my wallet. My I just don't. I just don't. So whatever bag I get, I'm, I try to get a neutral print or a neutral tone so that I can wear it with every single thing um, every day without even having to worry about it. So this was my bag from last year and I paid $7.75 for it. I got it from The Real Real and it was a really good deal because I found them for a couple of hundred dollars, even more than that, um, used, pre-loved. So, um, it was a really good deal and I definitely got my wear out of it. So this was a great. All right, guys. So the next item I'm going to show you are a pair of my Christian Louboutins, my red bottoms, um, Lubies. I love these shoes. What woman doesn't love red bottoms? But they're pony hair animal print slides and I paid about $2.95 for these. And I'll put them up close so you can kind of see the details. I mean, they are absolutely gorgeous. They are great to have in your collection and i got them for a really good price i mean 2.95 is not bad at all and they're super comfortable so this is another one of my favorites so let's just move to the next one all right guys so the next one i'm going to show you i am super excited about it it was my birthday gift for my 41st birthday this year and it is a ball mine bag some people say ball main but ball mine bag um it is so cute. I love it with the chain. It's a quilted leather bag and it is so soft and super just, it's so beautiful. I love crossbodies. I always wear a crossbody because I just think it's safer. I think it's safer to wear crossbody. Like you're gonna have to snatch my whole body up off of this um, to get this purse. So, and I know I'm not that big, but anyway, I love 
Love the details. Love the quilting. I love everything about this purse. Um, it's a little bit smaller than the Louis I had for last year, but um, it just made me get rid of some stuff in the process of putting everything in my bag because I do carry my purse for a full year before I put it in my closet. So um, for that one, I paid about seven, seven thirty-five. Um, so that was a really, really good price. And honestly, um, the investment in these purses are so worth it because they're not gonna fall apart on you. I mean, you can buy a dupe or whatever like that. Um, and some brands, um, I don't think they even have started doing that yet in Balmain, but I, Balmain, but I could be wrong. Um, but it's so worth it because you don't have to worry about your purse falling apart and um, you're gonna get your money's worth. So that is one, I have one more thing to show you, and um, it is a Versace watch. I'm just gonna grab it. Um, this was a gift, this was an actual gift. The box, it came with the box, and the box is a little bit raggedy, but um, I'm gonna open it and show, show you. It was a gift from my husband for Christmas last year. Um, he actually was in Africa, so he wanted to get me something really, really nice. And it comes with the, the box and everything. It came with the box and everything. Um, I'm probably going to get the band changed out next year, but um, it's a really, really, really cute watch. Um, I wear it a lot, actually, but um, he he told me how much he spent for it, but I'm just, it, since it was a gift, I don't want to be tacky. So it was a gift, but it was a luxury consignment, one of my favorite finds. So I just wanted to show this one last. So it's my Versace watch, and it has the little embellishments there. So that is that. And if you guys like this video and you would like for me to do more like this, I can do um, one for just luxury finds that I have that are not consignment. Or if you want me to do another consignment type um, video, I would be happy to. So just let me know in the comments and let me know in the comments if you like any of the items that I've shown you. And thank you. And I'll see you guys next week. Don't forget to like and subscribe.